presented by Church Tech U, it's the Pro Presenter Show. On today's show, how to troubleshoot video issues with a little known feature in Pro Presenter. Welcome again, my friends and fellow Eternity Changers, to the Pro Presenter Show. This is the show where I help you learn about Pro Presenter. My name is Paul Allen Clifford. And before we get started, make sure you click on subscribe and the little bell icon so that you can be among the first to learn the new tips and tricks I share. Sometimes you'll need to figure out what's going on with your video system. Is it the video card? Is it the rest of the system? Well, recently I stumbled upon a setting I'd never noticed before and found out that it helps you with just this issue. So let's head over to my computer and take a look. Okay, let's start by going into ProPresenter Preferences, which you can get to by either clicking ProPresenter and Preferences or Command Comma, which is what I just did. Now we want to go into Advanced. You can tell that I was already here. And down here, um, this doesn't have anything to do with um, the particular setting that I'm talking about today. I just had it to play with it. But here is what it is. So now if we look at that video, you'll see that we've got more settings listed on in ProPresenter. So uh, on the output specifically, you can kind of see them over here. But when I cut to the video I recorded, you see that there are a lot more settings. So, well, more information at least. It says Intel, etc. Uh, video memory, PBO, FBO, um, etc. So those are the pieces of information that you need to know about. So let me click this and watch as I change to, say, the element transitions example. See how the video memory changes and uh, the FBO changes. We'll go through that one more time just to show you how that is. Now I go to this one. Nothing on the screen. Notice the, it changed again. Now I'm going to add in my lower third. And it changes once again. And it comes out. Finally, let's go with a video background and you'll notice the video memory popped up pretty heavily so that gives you a little bit more information but what you might not know is what PBO and FBO mean so I'm gonna leave a link in the description below um, and that will help you um, learn that just in general, if what you're doing is always pegging the video memory, then that could be a problem. And let me clear this. If um, you're getting higher numbers on PBO and FBO, that could be a problem. So this is just another tool in your toolbox when you're troubleshooting video issues in ProPresenter 6. There's so much in ProPresenter that sometimes you forget how much. This is one of those things. Now you know what it does and why you'd use it. If you like this content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. But if you really want to level up your ProPresenter knowledge, don't forget that you can enroll in any of my ProPresenter mini-courses for free. Just go to tdm.fyi tutorials mini. 
Until next time, this is Paul Allen Clifford with TrinityDigitalMedia.com and ChurchTechU.com reminding you to go out and change eternity.